Then to the front off. Turn the gas off first. And the other thing. Cool down for a little bit. Take the silver couple out so we don't lock it. Mm. Right, so let's get some sawdust in here. I'm going to lift it out with these big, big bits. Give a bit of sugar. Okay. Right, let's try the white sugar because that doesn't seem to be sticking on quite so well. Wait, that's nice. You've only got a short amount of time to work on it. Now, we've got some sawdust inside, we're probably going to make it crack. There it goes, it's cracking. But I want to get some smoke on the inside of it. Try to. Oh, look, it's nice sawdust there. It might be a bit too much. Yeah, stinky. Let's go with a bit more sugar so I can get some dark spots on it. Some inside, some spots inside it. A blob there. Okay, I think I'm happy with that. Let's make a little mark. Some little vines. lines there where it's cracked. Yeah. 
the sweaty mask. Ugh. Now we're just going to leave it to cool till we can move it and then we'll wash it off. And some of those, some of this smoking will go as opposed to the really dark lines. Pleased with that one. It's got a few cracks in it. So that pinging is the glaze cracking as it cools. It has a frit in it that allows it to do that. If it didn't, the whole thing would just crack, fall really badly crack. The body of the clay, not just the glaze. I'm wondering if it's got a black foot, which might be kind of quite nice. Black base. It's so tempting to touch it. <laughs> it's so hot. <laughs> and get a bit more smoke on the inside and it has worked a little bit it is grey in there as opposed to white as it was time for a cup of tea